One of the most common questions that we get is, what is the crime in this neighborhood like? Stay tuned, today I'm gonna to tell you all about where to find your crime stats when you're shopping for a home. Hey there, if you like videos like these and wanna stay up to date on the Seattle real estate market, be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel so you can get alerted when all of our new videos come out and you can be the first to know about Seattle real estate. So you're shopping for a home, or maybe you're selling your home, and you want to know what crime is like in the neighborhood. So I, as a real estate broker, cannot tell you about crime or lead you to any demographic information about the neighborhood that you're look looking in, but one of the best websites to go to is spotcrime.com. You can go on their interactive maps, and they have little emojis that tell you all about different types of crime that are happening in the neighborhood. So you can see vandalism or theft, you can see robbery. Um, you can also see things like if there's a shooting or anything like that. And it has a little emojis in the neighborhood where you might be shopping. It's one of the best resources you can use to figure out what crime is like in the neighborhood that you may be shopping in or in your neighborhood if you're thinking about selling. There you have it, a little tip for when you're shopping or selling to figure out the crime in the neighborhood that you're looking in. If you have any other questions about shopping or about selling your home, we're here to help and we'd love to speak with you. You can call, text, direct message us, or just like this post or share it with someone who you think might find it helpful. We'd love to have you do that. If you have questions about buying or selling in this market, we're here to help. We offer a free buyer and seller consultation. It's no cost to you and we will prepare you better than anyone else on how to get your home ready for sale or how to get yourself ready to buy a home. Thanks for tuning in. We'll see you again next week.